Hey girls, long time no video and I'm so sorry. I've just been really busy with school and stuff. I know I say that every time that I don't make a video. But I just haven't really been in the filming mood and I have really ran out of ideas what to film. I've came up with a few ideas. I decided I'm going to be doing a spring lookbook, a makeup collection, and as soon as I get to 150 subscribers there will be a huge surprise for you girls. So if you're new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, I suggest you click the little subscribe button at the top and stay tuned for my videos. And yeah, so today I have a haul for y'all. Um, it's a spring drugstore makeup haul along with high-end makeup and a bit of clothing. And yeah, let's just jump right into it and I'll see you at the end of the video if you've noticed any changes. Well, let's just start with the things I got at the drugstore. I went to Shoppers Drug Mart, which is like a CVS or a Walgreens or whatever you call it, but I think it's just a Canadian drugstore. And first thing I picked up was the Yes 2 Carrot Soothing Sensitive Skin Gentle Milk Cleanser. And I am in love with anything that's scented like cucumbers because usually they're the really sweet smelling cucumber scents. And this smells like heaven in a bottle. I haven't used it yet just because I have a lot of other facial cleansers. But troubles in paradise. I haven't used this yet because I have a lot of other facial cleansers that I wanted to use up, but um, this was on sale for like $6, and that's a really good deal for Yes to Cucumbers. I think I said Yes to Carrots, but it's Cucumbers. The next thing I got, which I've already started using, and I realized it's a little shade too dark for me, but I guess when I tan I'll be able to use it, it's the Maybelline New York Is It Age Rewind Erase Dark Circle Makeup Foundation, and this is from 320. 320 honey. 320 honey. 20 honey. 20 honey rhymed all day. The sponge applicator, and I like this a lot, except I can't really wear it yet. But I just like the full coverage of it, and it's really lightweight on my face, and it doesn't leave my face greasy and oily. Except for, I think, three quarters of the way, like when the day is done, I do get like really shiny and oily, but I'm pretty sure every foundation does that to me. And to go along with that, I got the Maybelline Instant Age Rewind Dark Spot Eraser. It's the same kind of concept with the sponge applicator, but this is for my under eyes and my dark spot correcting. And this is in the shade 310 Fair Light. So yeah, there's a big difference between 320 Honey and 210 Fair Light. Um, but I haven't tried this out yet because I have another, like, a lot of other concealers I have to start using. Concealer. But yeah, before I start using this one, I have to clean use. I have to finish up all my other concealers, Orly's. Little Miss Sunshine, and this is Quo by Orly. And this is just a nice lemony yellow color with a lot of shimmery flecks in it. It's like shimmery flecks of pink and purple, and a little bit of gold too. And I just really, really like this color, and I don't really have a color like this, so I decided I'd pick this up, and this was only $2. Then I picked up two eyeshadow trios. One is the Quo Eyeshadow Trio in Earth Rituals. And I just love the packaging of this. Like, this is just so pretty and so cute and so just compact and sleek. And then you open it up, and it comes with a matte, off-white, creamy color, a silver, gray sparkle color, and a chocolatey brown sparkle color. So if you can't see, you have, like, the matte off-white, the silvery gray, and then the chocolate brown. Then I picked up another trio, and this is the number 7 Stay Perfect number 10 Renaissance trio, and I haven't opened this yet, but I just thought um, it'd be really cute to have, like, you know, if I ever do giveaway, 150 subscribers, surprise, if you can get what I'm going at. I just thought it'd be good to just, you know, keep an extra, like, I just, I've been, like, picking up a lot of products lately, and just kind of keeping them away, just for a special surprise, 150 subscriber giveaway. I might be doing a giveaway if you haven't, you know, got the picture already. It was Ikea, I forgot. To mention this at the beginning of the video, but I went to Ikea and they have candles there that surprisingly smell really good. And this is in Tandra. I think they're all the same. You know, like, they're all named Tandra or Tindra. All I know is that they smell delicious. I went to MAC and I haven't shopped at this store for a really long time just because I haven't really been needing anything. And I was going to get the Painterly Paint Pop, but they were all out of stock. So the next thing I wanted was a MAC powder blush. And this is a really popular color. This is in the color Well Dressed, but yeah, it's in the shade Well Dressed, and it's this pretty pink, just looks like this, 
and it's like a pinky purple and it's just really light and this is a satin finish and I'll just do a swatch for you girls it just looks like this that pink color on my wrist I don't know if you can see it. it's right there but yeah I picked up a blush I've just been really just wanting a new blush lately and I know I just picked up one in my last haul but I just really wanted a springy blush I oh, just stitches, and stitches surprisingly has a lot of good things for spring. First thing I picked up were a pair of leggings, because where I live, it is still snowing. Sadly. So I picked up a pair of cross leggings. I just thought they were really cute and really fun. And I've seen a lot of people wearing the cross theme. Those were $10. Then I picked up a pair of high-waisted shorts, just so when it stops snowing. They're white, and they're high-waisted, and they're studded, and they're beautiful, and they just have rips. And these are $20. And then, I picked up this cute little crop top to wear with the white shorts. And it's like a really short shirt. Like, it goes about a few inches above my belly button. And I just like this. It's cute tangerine orangey color. That's everything I got. Um, I just want to let you girls know that everything that I got was over like the span of two weeks. I didn't buy it all at once, even though there's not really a lot of stuff here. But still, I didn't buy it all at once. And also, if you haven't noticed, I got my hair done. I decided to get a middle part just to get like pieces to frame my face. And then I got it lightened. And yeah, I just really love my hair now. So, um, yeah, thanks for watching, girls. Comment, subscribe, check my channel. Definitely go check out my other videos. And also, comment down below your favorite spring trends or spring themes. And also videos you want to see coming up next. So, yeah. Bye, girls.